"'Twas the night before Vlogmas, when all through the house, not a puppy was stirring, not even a mouse. Cameras were charged by the outlets with care, burnout looming above us. Help me, I'm scared. The puppies were resting, cookies baking in the oven. The calendar was stuffed with plans by the dozen. As the night winds down, we snuggle up in bed. As the worries of Vlogmas begin to haunt Remy's head. All right, Rem. It's your 10th year of Vlogmas. You ready? I don't know. I just keep feeling like something's gonna go wrong. You'll be fine. Okay. Good night. Good night. and welcome to Vlogmas Day 18. Hello guys, good morning. I cannot believe it is Vlogmas Day 18 already. Every time I vlog in the car and people walk by, I get so nervous that they're just like laughing at me. Hello, good morning. I am currently getting ready in the car. Did I just say that? I don't know, I'm sorry. I'm still waking up. I just put on my Summer Fridays Rich Cushion Cream. I love that I'm doing a get ready with me on the side of the road on a very busy street in LA. I have already had an amazing morning. I will say I am very sleepy and I'm still waking up, but Last night I went to bed pretty late because I was up editing the vlog until like 1 a.m. or so, or I guess rather this morning I went to bed really late. And then I had to get up super early because I just had an early morning appointment with my PCOS specialist, which made me feel so good, you guys. Never in my life have I ever left a doctor feeling good. And I truly got emotional when I was leaving because she's just, she's just great. She listens to what I say. She cares about me. She cares about what I say. She was like, is the scales triggering you? Don't wear yourself. What matters so much more than what's on the scale is how you feel. That's what matters most. We're here to make sure that you feel healthy and you feel strong. And it was just really nice to hear. So I am just in a really good mood. And today is going to be such a fun day. I'm quickly getting ready now because I am about to go to Mia's house and I'm going to go meet up with Mia and we are going to go on a fun little food tour. Mia introduced me to this really fun like food hall, food court plaza in Orange County called The Source. And it's in Buena Park. If you guys are in the area and you like K-pop and you like Korean food, then you must go. Also, I'm like pretty much out of this foundation. You must go. It is so good. The food is amazing. It's fun to just try like little fun street foods that you would get in Korea if you're in Korea. Obviously, I love K-pop, so it's so much fun for me to go and see all the stuff that they have. And it's just a really fun time. They have good desserts, good food, good music, all the things. I did a vlog a while back where Mia and I were trying some of the food there and you guys loved it. So I figured it'd be a fun little day for Mia and I to bond and get you guys some good vlogmas content. And it's just gonna be such a good time. I love hanging out with Mia. She's like the most hilarious person I've ever met in my entire life. And it's gonna be a good time. We'll try some good food. I'll share with you guys what we eat. Oh my God, I did not even blend that foundation on this cheek. <laughs> I'm really just thinking about how much of a better headspace I'm in than I was a few years ago and also my relationship with food that I have now than it was a few years ago. If you've been following me for a while, wow, I have a lot of little baby chin breakouts. I think Miss Flo is coming. The holiday season is always obviously a time where we all are thinking about food a lot more than just normally in the year. Also, let me lower the steering wheel. So sorry, Cal definitely raised it because he's so tall. There we go. Obviously, finding a good relationship with food is so hard. I know we all can agree on that. And a few years ago, when I was not doing well with my relationship with food, I remember the holidays were so hard because I was so restrictive of myself and I, you know, would not indulge in any like fun holiday treats leading up to Christmas. I would barely eat at Christmas dinner and I was just so hard on myself. And even like the Big Bear trips, I wouldn't allow myself to have cookies and like have all the fun things with my friends. I'm super, super grateful for people in my life like Mia and Lauren because they have such healthy relationships with food and have so much balance that it's taught me so much about my own personal relationship and that it's okay to have cookies. It's okay to indulge. And there's always a way to find a balance between indulging, but also taking care of yourself. It's taken me so long to get to this point. Like today, I'm excited to go and have fun with my friend and eat some fun food. And then also, you know, I'll have a nice nutritious meal for dinner and finding the balance between the two. I know that 
this is a hard time of year for a lot of people for so many different reasons and food being one of them. And if you guys are going through that, I feel you. I've been there. I'm actively working on it every day. I'm definitely not perfect, but I'm trying my best and that's all that we can do. But if you guys are feeling that way right now, trust me, you are not alone in the slightest. I know it can definitely be a hard and triggering time of the year, but just like my doctor said, it's about how we feel, not the number on the scale. If weighing yourself is triggering you, do not do that. It's not important. Wow, I just left that doctor's appointment feeling really good and I'm really, really happy. But okay, let me just finish up my little makeup in the car real quick. And then I'm gonna go run and get a coffee because I gotta wake up and then we will go over to Mia's house and I'm so excited. It's gonna be so fun. I guess, you know what? Should I speed through the car makeup? Let's speed through the car makeup. While I do this, I will pop on some Vlogmas. Whose Vlogmas should I start with? <gasps> Sierra Schultz posted. Here I go. Found this cute little coffee shop to go to. Got my latte. Also, the man literally walked it up to me at the table I was sitting. So kind. Also, I have my merch back on. I wasn't able to bring it to Big Bear because I didn't finish my laundry fast enough, so I knew it was waiting for me at home. And it looks so cute, and so many of you guys are getting yours in the mail now, and I'm so happy you're loving it. I obviously love it, but to see you guys love it means so much more, so I'm happy. Cheers to that. Actually, wait, before then, five sips, everybody. The coffee shop was called Please Enjoy. Here we go. Mmm. Mm. Right off the bat, so smooth, so creamy. Wow, I love that. I'm by the beach, so the weather's just like nice and brisk. And there's like, look at this view right now. All these palm trees, like it's so beautiful. They had matcha in there too, but I was just craving a hot latte today and this is hitting the spot. Hello all, we are here. Look who's here. <gasps> look how good she looks. Oh, you look good. Can I get a little outfit of the day perhaps? Oh. Oh. Just from Amazon. Really cute. She's Crocs. a Crocs. Oh my God, I love the chains on the Crocs. Chains That's so cute. <gasps> so cute. So cute. is from, I don't remember, some online store, I don't remember. I burnt it. Oh, it looks cute. A nice little texture. Mickey, the boobs turn. look amazing. Oh, oh thank, thank you. you so much. Bow is from Reval. The bow is so cute. Thank you. I hope my extensions aren't showing. I was in a rush this they're morning. They're not, they're not. Merch is shopremycruise.com. Leggings are aloe, boots are UGG. Cute, and bag, bag. Bag is Prada. <gasps> Goals. Thank you so much. So we're gonna go eat our way around the source. Also, the last time we were here was probably like six months ago, probably longer, right? It's been a while. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of new stores here, and I'm hoping to find some twice things because When's our concert? March 16th, I think it is, which tickets? I am going. We got tickets, you guys. I'm gonna be there. If you're gonna be there, let me know. But the food is amazing. They have so many like clothing stores. We're here a little bit early, so they're actually not fully open yet, but we're just walking around. They've got food, stores, music, all the things. Do Look at this line. Thing. That's gotta be good if there's a line that long. It's fried chicken. There's gotta be like a meet and greet with a chicken or something, right? <laughs> <laughs> like why is the line so long? First up, we have K Fancy Accessory and K-Pop. Here we go. Look at all the cute accessories. This reminds me of Paris Kids in Tokyo, where I buy all my bows at. This is so Paris Kids. This is so Paris Kids, and Mia knows what Paris Kids is, obviously, because she is- on her, on a Takeshita Street? Takeshita yeah. Street. Ah! All the little bows and headbands. Oh my God, hair clips. <gasps> a sparkly hair clip. Don't mind if I do. Hey girls, all K-pop, 30%. Oh my God. Hey girls, you look so good. Hey girls. <laughs> I found twice tattoos. Shall I? I'll do like, what should I do as a, tra a tramp stamp? Oh my God, I love it. Put some back. <laughs> I want one of these little twice mirrors. Is there one? No, BTS. Oh my God, wait, actually I should get BTS stuff for my mom's stocking for sure. She'll take this mirror. <laughs> I found myself a twice mirror. I will be getting this. I'm getting myself these twice pens and I'm putting it in my stocking. <laughs> these are so cute. I want to put my keys on this one. It's so adorable. I'm getting Cal this Momo pop socket. This was one of my favorite K-pop songs in high school. 
It's an IU song from like 2013. So much cute jewelry to choose from too. Mia and I both like these earrings, so I'm gonna buy them for her and surprise her. Look at these little mini soju keychains. They've got like big bottle keychains, so funny. They're playing wedding dress. The way I watched this music video a million times and it had the biggest crush on him. My princess. <laughs> and we can match twins. She's already putting them in. That was so fast. Let's see. Should I put mine on too? Yes. Match. Okay. We're matching. <laughs> I will say with the hair bow and these bows, it might be a lot of bows today. Thank you so much. Okay, now we're gonna go get, last time we were here, we thought that they closed down forever, but they must've just been closed for that day. It's called Overflow and they have the best rose tofoki. It's so good. It's Think about so it. Good. Like, it's by Roman Empire. It, <laughs> it's really good. So we're gonna get that and then we'll keep it moving. Other K-pop store. <gasps> oh yes, Overflow time. And then we love this cosmetic world. They have all the Korean skincare and stuff. Okay, here's the menu. We've got kimchi fried rice, spam fried rice. Here's what we like, the tteokbokki. We get the rose one. It's sauce, sausage, bacon, udon noodles. <gasps> the glass noodles. Ooh, they all look good though. <gasps> they have fish cake udon and then they have ice cream. Do you want a drink too? They've got drinks over here. Ooh, ice cream latte, what? Jolly Pong latte, I don't know what that is. It looks like a, what was that? cereal with the frog on it. Do you remember? Oh, it's like a, like a, like a crunchy. It kind of looks like this, right? I didn't like them, oh, yeah. but I remember the, the frog on there. I can't with my two like greasy strips here. I thought it looked cute. Perhaps I should have put it back. Perfect energy, yeah we flawless, yeah we free. I'm gonna talk loud over the K-pop. We got it, this is big, it's heavy. There's a lot in here. Yeah, it looks bigger than usual. Oh my god. Okay, so they don't do rice cakes anymore, they do udon noodles, but it's to die for. Okay, chopsticks for you. Ooh, we share everything. Go, go, go. We share everything here so we can eat more. <laughs> Look at this glass noodle. It's so wide. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh, good catch. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's spicy. It my God. Good. I don't know what flavor it is, but it's so good. Here I go. Udon noodle. It's amazing. It's just like a flavor I've never had before. It's not like normal gochujang with cream. It's like, I don't know what's in it, but it's, it's like smoky almost. Mmm, it's so good. I gotta cut the camera, so I gotta eat this. Next on our routine, we come to Sweetbox and they have Tong Hulu. <gasps> you best bet I'm getting that and they have the best macarons ever. Mia and I are obsessed with them. I like the cookies and cream flavor specifically. <gasps> the blue one, here it is. And they're usually really chewy and delicious. <gasps> the snowman, the stocking. Is that a My Melody? Kind of looks like My Melody. These are so cute. I will say Mia said the last time she came, they weren't as good, so we're hoping for the best. Oh, she's a food blogger. These look insane. Oh, wow. She got all of them. Oh, my God. Ah. <gasps> they have a tangerine one, too. Should we try tangerine? Okay. Could I do a tangerine? Do you guys you have, have tangerine Oh, today. that's okay. Sorry. That's okay. Can I just do a cookies and cream macaron then? Just that, please. It's like we're in Japan. <laughs> When are we going to Japan together? Girl, you tell me when. I've never tried the purple grape, I don't think. Also, I hope I don't break a tooth. Oh, hold on. Mmm. I'm a purple grape over a green grape person. I don't like sour grapes. That's really sweet. Mmm. Green grape. Sorry, Dr. Gabe. I'm so worried I'm gonna have a Tana moment one of these days. Have you seen her veneer just like fully pop out? <laughs> I have to be so careful. All of these are real teeth though. It's only the front, so I have to. The four, right? Uh huh. Oh, mmm. Wow. I don't know what my favorite is. What's your favorite? Is it strawberry or green grape? Green grape, me too. Here we go. Okay. Ooh. It's still good, right? It's good, but not as good as before. Yeah. Before it had this like chew to it. It kind of tastes dry and old. Yours is chewy. Yours is, is that chewy? Yeah. Not less chewy than the ones before. No, 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 mine was so different. Really? Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, wait. Maybe it's the flavor. What flavor did you get? I have faith now. Before I felt like it almost had like a pull to it a little bit. Mine was literally oh, pink. I got it too far here. That's chewy. I'm gonna go back and get more. Mmm. They put like a buttercream on the inside. Like I feel like a lot of pieces just do like frosting of some sort or like a jam. It's like a delicious, rich buttercream. Mia is now on the hunt for the chewy macaron flavor, so she's getting another one. Update, if you come here, I would get the macarons over the Tom Hulu, but 
both are good. She was so nice, she gave me a one for free because she said hers wasn't as chewy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's the good shit. Oh my god. She got it. She got it. That's perfect. It's also just like really oh, cold. This one's really chewy. Okay, that's true. Uh huh. That's what I wanted. The pull. Mm -hmm. Oh. That's a good one. That's good. We're coming back. Okay. We're gonna make a round. We're going to K Place, another K pop store. Then we'll get a sandwich. And then more macarons. <laughs> She's in euphoria. <laughs> She's so happy. We're going to Cosmetic World. They have fun Korean makeup and skincare here, which you know is always good. Oh, God, I need some hand sanitizer. These are what Eros uses on me. I think they're called like. Peri Peri or something? Yeah, Peri Para. They have so much skincare here, all these sheet masks. These are really popular too, these little like pads that come in these little containers. I see these everywhere. <gasps> Snail mucin eye patches. That's cool. There's so many options. Ooh, I wanna try. Ollie's been telling me to try the snail mucin so much. Okay, I think I'm gonna try the salicylic acid. Found more snail things. Oh, they've got a lot of stuff in this brand. Plum, glowing, hydration, boost. I got some good stuff for myself and for Christmas gifts. I got a haul. And now we're going to, I think my favorite place here, which is called, I think we call it Flipoli. Flipoli. We always take a little uh, photograph in the photo booth here. And they have like Korean street food and sandwiches. Oh, I think they got a little bit of a facelift, Mia. Look at this wooden wall. That's new. What are you looking over here? Something? <gasps> More pens. I'm obsessed with the chick wearing a chick costume. That is so cute. Time for Flipoli. Oh, I can't wait. Look at this new and improved wall they put in. How stunning is that? Come on, and the new table for us to sit at? <laughs> so they have all these options for sandwiches. Egg, ham and cheese. Mia likes the ham and cheese, and I'm not normally a ham fan, unless it's like a croissant. You know, I keep saying that, but I'm like, I like this and I like that. This one is bomb. Bacon cheese, bulgogi barbecue, hash brown mozzarella cheese, kimchi bulgogi, and they have all these drinks. We have tried the fresh green grape. We liked that. Mia said to surprise her with something. Oh, we tried the Dalgona coffee too. That was good, but I think today we will try, I wanna try a banana latte. Ooh, let's try the Angel Me latte. Ooh, no, 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 okay, we'll try the strawberry latte and the Angel Me latte. And then I'm gonna do the ham and cheese. You know what, this is actually a cute. Oh my God. Oh my God, of course. Wait, do you wanna be in Vlogmas? <laughs> Guys, this is Grace. She's amazing. Yeah, nice to meet you. That's beautiful, by the way. Really? You too. You're so sweet. Oh my god, you're so sweet. Thank you. Nice to meet you. She's so nice. Okay, so we got the strawberry latte. They were out of the angel me, so we got Oops, sorry, blue lemonade. No, you're good. Blue lemonade. And then here is our sandwich. Oh my god. I don't even know how to take this thing out. Oh my god, it's like. I feel like everyone thinks like there's no way it can be that good when it looks this good. It's even better than you imagine. It's insane. So it's egg, like a mayo, spicy mayo, cheese, and ham in there. Mm. This is carbonated. Ooh. Blue lemonade. That is so good. You're gonna love it. She loves milk. <laughs> it just tastes like ice cream. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh my god, it's so good. I don't even know how to begin cutting this thing. It's just so big. Here, idea, idea, idea. Yeah, I'm so fucking excited for this. It's so big. Cheers. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Nailed it yet again. Can't wait to add it to my stack. That's my fave. Yes, these are perfect. I put my little strands back because suddenly the hair on my face started to really irritate me. And then I had like a weird sensory issue. So she's back now. I feel good. I stopped at Trader Joe's on the way home to see if they had any more kimbap and they didn't. But look who I caught going on a walk on the way home. Hello. Hello. Hi vlog. Hi baby. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm good. <laughs> Hello guys! Okay, I am home. It's now 6.30 p.m. I have been cleaning since the minute I got home, which probably was like, what? Maybe like 3 p.m. or so. I have not stopped cleaning and I still have so much to do tonight. You know like those times where you're just, for some reason, moving like a snail? I don't know what it is, but I had a bunch of packages that I needed to go through, a lot of which were Christmas gifts and we're actually doing our first official Christmas exchange, gift exchange, tomorrow with all 
Molly and Alicia and we're actually going to Mammoth in the morning as well. I wasn't sure if I was gonna go until literally today. We waited to book until today because I wanted to make sure that I was fully healthy and everything was okay to go. So we're leaving in the morning, which means I need to still, I have to put laundry away. I need to pack for tomorrow. And I also need to wrap up all of Ollie and Alicia's gifts because we're gonna do the exchange in the morning. So I'll show you guys everything that I got for them. Also, side note, I got myself a little Christmas gift and I actually got a new lens for the camera. So let me pause, take this in right now and let me change it. Okay, here we go. This is the new lens. So this is a fixed lens before I could actually, what is that do? Oh, wait, that's so cool. I need to play around with it a little bit, but before I could zoom in or out, but this one actually creates a blurry background for you guys. Let me know if you like it. This is cool. Wow, that's really beautiful. It reminds me of the Sigma 30 millimeter lens that every lifestyle YouTuber had way back in the day. If you guys watched uh, YouTube back in like 2014, then you know what I'm talking about. There's like a little button here that I gotta figure out how to use, but yes. Okay, so there's so much to do on the schedule tonight. Looney, I love you so much but I'm trying to vlog. So on the schedule, you're so cute. I need to finish cleaning up everything. I need to go upstairs, put the laundry away, do all that. We need a pack. And I also need to clean up the living room so that it's ready for our gift exchange tomorrow. And then we need to wrap up all the presents. So we have a lot to do. Oh my goodness. You are too cute. Oh, and we also need to do today's small business haul, obviously. And I need to show you guys what we picked up earlier. There is so much to do tonight and only so many hours in the day. Originally, Cal and I actually had reservations to go to a little holiday bar tonight. It was so cute. It's like super decked out with Christmas things and all of the cute little holiday cheer. But I told him, I think I just have too much on my plate tonight. So I don't think we're gonna make it, which makes me sad. But he understands tonight, Vlogmas comes first. <laughs> is she falling asleep like this? Are you falling asleep like this? I understand why Malshies are called teddy bears because you are a little teddy bear. All right, let's get to it, shall we, Lulu? Yay! Okay, wish me luck, guys. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna write all this down. I've got my cute little notepad situation here. All right, for tonight, we need to haul source things. I need to haul small business. I need to put laundry away. If you've ever wondered what my uh, penmanship looks like, it's this. I don't have good penmanship. I never have. I feel like learning about someone's penmanship or like seeing how someone writes is like one of the craziest things because you kind of have like an idea of what it's gonna look like. Yeah, mine's not very cute. Okay, put laundry away. This is why I'm taking so long today. I keep getting distracted. I need to clean living room, edit vlog. I need to pack for mammoth, wrap presents. All right, I can't think of anything else right now. This is the list for tonight. Oh, I do need to shower. I just like to write things on here that I'm already gonna do, but it feels good to check it off. All right, let's get to it. Hello, everybody. Updates. Okay, I'm gonna do the small business haul of the day. I actually have no idea what this is. So let's open her up. Oh, also, can you see I hung the stockings on the stairs so much better. They look so cute. I can't wait to fill those up when we're back home. Okay, today's small business haul comes from Oh my God, okay, I'm really excited about these. Actually, this is so perfect, but this small business haul comes from Atomic Buttercup. What a cute name. Here's our box, let's open her up. We have some cute little glitter tissue paper and a little card. Ah, oh my God, wait, this is so perfect. Okay, Sandy, thank you so much. She said that she's so excited and she's so honored to be sending this package. I made some extra special matching purses for Alicia and I. Oh. So I'll give them to her tomorrow. Oh my God, too cute. I was truly so in love with all the different things on the website. Of course, I will link her down below. If you guys wanna use code THANK YOU in all caps, you can get 20% off your order. So that is amazing, there you go. And then, here we go. Okay, these, oh my God, okay, I know what this is. It's so cute. These are like so adorably coquette, which is perfect for all the trends going on right now. Look at this little jewelry box. That cool. looks like a cake. This is so cute. Oh my God, you guys. Okay, so I got this one that's pink with the little cherries on it, a little bow, the little fake frosting, and then inside, oh my God, it's like a little vanity. There's a mirror, and then you can add in like little jewelry, trinkets, 
whatever you want. Honestly, I'm gonna keep this in my room and put my engagement ring in there when I am not wearing it. This is perfect. So, so cute. Okay, that's the first one. And then I ordered another one, which I believe is this one. I think this is the bigger one. How she wrapped them is so cute. Oh, this is absolutely adorable. And I'm gonna put these in my glam room. This is a little tissue box holder that looks like an adorable cake. Wow, the cherries look so realistic. <gasps> How cute is this? It's decorated like a cake and you put your tissue box in and you can pull the tissues out. I'm always needing to blow my nose, so I'm gonna use these all the time. Or honestly, I think I'll put this in the office actually. So cute, I love this so much. The cherries really, like they look so real. Oh my God, so cute. Little heart purses that say pretty basic. That is absolutely adorable. Oh my God, these are actually so cute and we can use them for an upcoming shoot that we have. Adorable, thank you so much, Sandy. I'm gonna leave her link down below, check her out. And now, Cal is gonna show me the wrapping paper that he got. All of you guys were asking for me to react to it and I haven't really seen them yet, so Cal is gonna do that. I would like to know the thought process behind why you chose what you did. Would no you like thoughts. to tell? Just five. Would you like to tell them thank you for how sweet they were for- Thank you for all the nice words. Your vlog You guys clips. were way too nice. Carl. I did literally nothing. Carl, you did great. Hey. Okay. Don't call me Carl. Okay, first one. First one is, I think we already had this one before. Beautiful. So I just thought, why not get some more of that? Red with snowflakes, that's beautiful. And then kind of like a Ooh, theme that matches the house. Wait, that's so good, yeah. good job. We got a black and white snowflake with some gold accents. Then I thought this was a nice vibe. Some I love. pickup truck with um, a Christmas tree. I love back. this, so yeah. festive, so cute, good job. Cal. And then we got two fun ones. We got sloths <gasps> and penguins. And penguins! Oh my god, I'm obsessed. Merry Slothmas. And little penguins. Okay, I yeah. think we should do some penguins. Some fun, some chill. Penguins you know? for Alicia? Yes. I agree. All right. Cal's gonna wrap up her gifts. So for her gifts, I got her a gold and silver watch because she and I have been talking about on Pretty Basic all the time how she's now wearing gold jewelry, but she wants to mix metals, but she doesn't have anything like that she can mix the metals with yet. So I thought how perfect a half gold, half silver watch so she could wear that and then mix all her metals really easily. But unfortunately, I'm a dummy and I sent it to her mom's house and not here. So unfortunately, I don't have it. I was doing nothing and nothing. Do it really again. Good. No. Okay, so I don't have that. But for her other gifts, what I got Alicia for Christmas. Okay, first up, I got her the Snickers Yard because as you guys saw, if you watched the other Vlogmas video, she really wanted this and she loves Snickers. So I got her this. I feel like I have more stuff for her too, but I can't remember like little like small things here and there. I also got her these smart goggles. These are a uh, Theragun, Therabody smart goggle. Apparently they're amazing. They can like warm your eyes. They help you sleep. They massage your eyes. They heat, they vibrate. She really wanted these. So I got her these. I also got her this, which is the same towel warmer that I have that I love so, so much. She's really in her relaxation era. So I figured this would be so nice for her to throw her towels into this warmer when she's taking a bath or when she's just like relaxing and then she can have a nice spa-like experience in her house. One of her vlogs was turning my bathroom into a spa. So I figured this was perfect. And then I got the watch. And then last but not least, dun, 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 dun. I got her a pressure washer. And the reason I got her this, if you guys missed it, she got robbed at her house and the guy stole a bunch of equipment and security cameras and all this crazy stuff. And the most important thing they took, her pressure washer. So I thought, why not give her one so she can clean her house and everything else. If you guys remember Maggot Gate, you know she probably needs this. Cal's gonna wrap up the Snickers and the goggles. There you go, my love, thank you. And then I'm too lazy to wrap all this stuff up, so I have this giant bag that I will be using for the towel warmer. Wow, okay, I think this is gonna be big enough. Uh, this is big enough for me. That's crazy. You <laughs> know? Please. I don't think it'll fit in there. You don't think so? Actually? I think it's just perfect. Woo! There wow, we go. Look at that. All right, present number one, done. Oh no, I ripped it, shoot. All right, I have to tape that. And then for this guy, let's wrap him. Just give me one second. How I'm gonna wrap this guy? Are you ready? I'm gonna take a giant bow. 
perfect. Put it right on top. Perfect. And then to really seal the deal, boom, there we go. She'll have no idea. Ta-da! I'm coming at you from my glam room. It is now 10.38 p.m. And for some reason, I decided to completely reorganize my closet. I don't know why I chose to do that, but I just spent like an hour doing that. And now I still need to pack and edit this vlog. I don't know why I chose to do that in such a random hour, but once I get an idea in my head, I am the kind of person that just like, has to do it right then and there. Very little patience. I don't know why I do that to myself, but I put all my laundry away, which is good. I'm wearing this really cute little set that was sent to me by my friend Susie, AKA Susie KB Fitness. This is from her brand, Isla Movement. It is so soft and comfortable. I'm gonna make these pajamas, like loungewear pajamas, super soft and cozy. The quality is amazing. Thank you so much, Susie. I love you. I also took a shower, so my hair is, you know, damp in the towel. Also, if you can't tell, I am sitting in a new chair and that is because I was officially influenced by Kim and Alicia, ma'am. The old chair is there and she has jumped up and, oh, her, oh, 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 oh. There you go, now you can sit and be comfy. If you guys recognize this chair, Kim Ty and Alicia Marie both got it and influenced me to get it and it's the chair that you can sit crisscross applesauce on and I have to say I really 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 enjoy it. This chair I've had for quite a few years since I moved into this house also. Hello. How are you doing? <laughs> that chair is so nice and comfortable. It's really, really big, but the thing is it's really deep. So when I do my makeup, I sit at the edge of the chair and I'm always hunching over. It's really bad for my posture. And then my back hurts, the whole thing. I'm moving this to the Pretty Basic Studio. I love it because I can scooch right up to the front. I can sit crisscross applesauce if I choose to do so. And I can move my mirror right up here and do my makeup and my hair with my back actually pressed up against something so it's not like I'm hunched over the whole time. Also, it's just really comfortable to sit in and I really like it. So, Cal built me this today, love it so much. And now, I'm going to pack for Mammoth. We're only going for a very short amount of time, but I wanna pull out some cute looks for some cute pictures. So I'm bringing lots of clothes. So, let's get to packing. I've already started forming my pile down here. There's my Alicia Marie Vlogmas magazine. There's Daisy. Here's Luna. I'm watching Michelle on my TV. This vlog's already getting long, so I'll just show you when I'm done packing. All right, I think I'm all packed up. On this side, I used my packing cubes under this Abercrombie scarf. This little scarf and headband is from Skims. I've got sweaters, I've got ski pants, I've got long sleeves and thermals and things for skiing. Because we're actually skiing, I have gloves. I just need to pack like a ski jacket. I'll decide on that tomorrow, along with my skis and my boots and everything, and my poles. I just need to throw my pajamas. I'm gonna wear these in there tomorrow. I've got my sweatshirt. Oh, sure, why not? And then on this side, I have my puffer jacket. I've got my little snow boots. In the purple bag, it's just like makeup, hygiene, contacts, glasses, all those things. Makeup there, hairbrush in there, curling iron. I think that's pretty much all I need. Every time I've been traveling lately, I feel like I'm forgetting something so important. I usually don't, and also it's such a short trip because I need to get back to start prepping things for Christmas for Cal's family. So I'm sure we'll be fine. Oh my God, Looney, I'm gonna let her stay there. All right, guys, I am going to end the vlog. I know I said that I would do the haul from this stuff earlier. Oh, also I have like pimple cream on right now. Please don't mind. I know I said that I was gonna do it earlier, but this vlog is getting so long already. So I promise I'll do the haul when I come back home and stuff all the stockings. That's gonna be so much fun. So expect that in a couple days. Until then, I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.